Hey everybody, we're just playing some more Magic the Gathering because I woke up and I chose Card Violence. And I don't know, I haven't played Magic in a while, so I felt the itch to bring it back again. And I'm not a fan of this hand, so we're gonna get, we're gonna scrap it. Um, yeah, this is better. Um, not particularly better. Actually, it's not that great. Okay, no black mana. Oh boy. Fuck it. You know, I might regret that, but we'll see. Maybe I should have kept that first hand. Yeah, so the premise around this is just kill kill his things with with spiders so that we can trigger Shelob and get copies of their things. That's the gist. So honestly getting this cultivate's kinda nice, because we can go turn some more land to get two swamps. Which is the only thing I'm kind of lacking in here. I also don't have a lot of creature power, and I'm going to be doing nothing for a while. While he's going to have a card draw and creatures, it's going to be it's, it's going to be a little slow for us. Not impossible, but it is very slow. Commander comes out. A little aggravating, but must be done. Shield counter? Yes. Okay. So he's gonna be drawing a bunch of cards, which is annoying. Um, okay. So here we're gonna do the cultivate. Give me two swamps, baby. So then we can go into file, and then if we want, we could, uh. Oh boy. Okay. Then we can drop Sheila, but he probably has a counter. Which he's probably gonna save here after he attacks. So actually, we might do Driven Odd first to bait the counter. Actually, kind of depends on what he uh, uses here, because he can also just um, slap an enchantment on Sheila too, which I'm, I'm not thrilled about. As long as she's on the battlefield, it doesn't matter. But um, let's see if he counters anything. So he could, he could counter, but he didn't. He has something instant speed. Which is intriguing. So that tells me he either has a counter or more draw spells. More cantrips. So I think I am going to stick with the plan of Drivenod and then see what he does. Drivenod, not Drivenod. What does he do? Four mana, five mana, six mana. What can you You can do a lot with six. What does he do? Not what I expected. So, okay, so we're gonna be taking six here? Five. Yep. Yeah. Okay, he still has three mana. So I'll be taking seven this turn. So let's uh let's attempt. Can I get both of these out? I cannot. Fuck. Well, yeah, we'll do Drivnod, which he'll counter. I'm assuming. This makes sense. And I have to take that on the chin. Five mana, okay, well, I think we're probably screwed here, but kind of depends on if he counters Shelob or not. He has the card, so he probably can. Seven damage, so we'll be at nine. Oh god. That's horrendous. Plenty of mana, he is not... Destroy all lands. Okay, well, that's us. Yeah, not much we can do about that. I, I just, uh, we were too slow, simply. On to the next one. Necrobloom, okay. 
I'm a fan. Yeah, because we can get two Black Wave, Sign and Blood, Mind Stone. Yeah, I'm good. I'm, I, can, I can work with this. Um, we'll use Bajuka right away. Kind of sad that we have to use it right away, but it's fine. Fabled. So he might be going a bit slower, too. We're going to be actually quite a bit quicker than last game. Arcane Signet for green. So we can do Mindstone into Sign and Blood. Well, actually, we should do Relic into Mind. So now we'll have six mana and we can drop Shelob if we want. Or we can go... <clears throat> Or we can go sign in blood. I'm actually gonna save Shelob and go for the sign in blood. Okay. This is fine. We'll drop Drivna to beta murder. Beta kill spell, hopefully. I'd rather him. Yeah. Okay. So I'd rather him kill this than Shelob, which is why I dropped him first. Maybe I should have dropped Mass Vandal, but he probably wouldn't have killed that. So he's probably gonna drop his command. He does not. Okay. Okay, so this is nice because we can do one of these. Um so we're just gonna kill the Gerog. Get a copy of the Gerog. Um so, Gitrog cannot attack, but we can play additional land on each of our turns. We just not basically lands you control into the battlefield. Your opponent's control, okay. So, um, he's probably gonna kill Shelob here, which is fine. He's um, spending four mana to do it, which is pretty horrendous. But um, now we can drop Paragon and Mass Vandal. Ooh. Should I do this? Okay, well, we're gonna do this. Just to sort of get them out here. And I think we're gonna wait to potentially, oh, we can sack a clue, I guess. We'll do that on his turn to make it seem like we have a kill spell. <laughs> Anointed? You and what tokens? Okay, we're gonna pass. See what he does. Okay, draw a card. Okay. Don't be another land, damn it. Okay. Okay. So six mana, that's not great. We're gonna see if he... One more token to be created. Okay, we're actually going to wait to see what he does. Because everything he has enters tap, so I'm not particularly... I guess we can just attack. Since it doesn't matter. Oh, he can... Oh, he can't. His cost three. Perfect. And if we want to, we can sack Mindstone to draw a card again. So, if we feel the need to, we can do that. I'm okay with this. I have no qualms with that. Okay, so that comes in tapped. Which I'm fine with. Bunch of oozes. A little annoying. Pretty unfortunate, I would say. So again, he he's kind of running out of options, but um, we are going to sack to draw a card. Okay. <laughs> um, that's fine. Get rid of swamp to grab a swamp enough forest. So we, I don't think we can cast Shelob and do traverse the Outlands, which is annoying. And he does have a card left, a single card. He's got anointed out. Lands cards and you have dredge too. Okay. This is kind of unfortunate. What can we do? So one, two. Yeah, I still can't cast this. Um, we're gonna see, cause he only has a card, one card in hand. We'll see if he has a kill spell. 
And he probably can't even cast it because it's gonna cost him more. Because it, it's Ward 2. So he can only do it on his main phase. That's fine. Uh, yeah. Forest, give me. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, I guess maybe we can do it now. Okay, no, we can't. Uh, in that case, we're just gonna take the swing. Because now if he decides to swing out, then he'll swing into Shelob, or he'll kill it and spend a bunch of mana doing something that he didn't want to. Or put Elish Norn in the graveyard, that's a problem. What is Dredge? Feed the Swarm. Okay, that's annoying. <clears throat> but I get it. Um, I might sack a food here? Yeah. Just to gain two light? Well, no, we're fine. Zombies. Two damage, negligible. Not bad at all. Okay. So, I think what we do here <clears throat> is save this in case we want something to be fought. So like if he drops an El Elish Norn, that might be an issue. But uh, we'll see what happens. For now, we're gonna poke him, see what he does. Well, actually, we'll just swing out. He's so low on health that he'll um, block with a bunch of... Or he won't. Actually, he's fairly smart to not block. Okay, you have a land. You have zombies, you have blockers, so you're still fine. You even have a uh, Faceless Haven, which I have to remember. It won't... It can't kill Sheila, but it'll kill these guys, so I have to keep that in mind. We're looking pretty good here, I would say. It's just a matter of um, whittling his blockers down and hoping he stops getting lands. It is gonna help that I'm gonna get eight basics of lands here after. Uh, yeah, okay. So land war waste, that's good. I'd prefer anything else, but. Okay. Yeah, he kinda, I bet you he probably figured that it was just a bit of a losing battle from that point. If he didn't have a board wipe, he wasn't really going to be able to do anything. One more. <clears throat> uh, uh, this is gross. This is gross, 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 gross. This is interesting. I'm not thrilled, but I don't think it's terrible. Um, yeah, I think I'll keep it. <clears throat> we'll see how it rocks. Let's go grab a forest. Okay, so he's probably gonna cast his commander next turn, which is unfortunate. Unfortunate. I'm still, I think, two turns away from doing that. Three turns. And I don't have a creature in sight, so he's probably gonna be drawing. Talion. Another opponent cast Talion. That's pretty. It's cast spell, cast a spell with mana value, power, or toughness equal to the chosen card that player loses. Okay, that's interesting. It's not terrible. So I'm not, I'm not gonna get that anytime soon. So I do have a bunch of fight spells, so that is kind of annoying. But it does not impede me terribly because I am going to eventually fight him and just get him. Um, that being said. 
um, the more, the longer it takes for me to get Shelob out, the more likely she'll get countered. So this is kind of getting a little... Okay, well, Daxos Talon. I'd probably get rid of Daxos first. Just to prevent the, like, life gain and gain some. Okay. I'm a fan of this. Huh, let's wait. I'm gonna try to bait a counter. <sighs> with Harrow. I mean, you never know. Some people are horny to counter, so they'll just counter anything without even knowing what it is. Commander comes out, probably. Right? I mean, that's what I would do. No land, it looks like, so he has only good stuff in his hand. Quote unquote. Oh, he does have a land. Okay. Don't know why it took him so long to decide to place a land down. Today, Junior. Bro's on mobile for real. There it is. Wizard class, okay. So does he draw or does he save for a counter? <clears throat> he draws. Which is interesting because that's <laughs> He has a bunch of stuff in hand, and it's probably murder stuff, so I, I'm hesitant to, to cast Shelob, to be quite frank. Because I could cast her and then immediately do a... Actually, I don't think I can cast her at all. Six, seven, yeah. Well, I have Blizzard Brawl, but that's a sorcery, so... Okay. Well, actually, I might be able to do that safely because he only has two mana. And he, uh, it would have to be... Yeah. So we're gonna do this and probably grab Daxos? Yeah, we'll grab Daxos. Hmm. Do we grab Daxos or Talion? Let's grab... Italian, because I might want the card draw more than the life. <clears throat> so he's only cast two and four. Okay. I might go four. Sacrifice this artifact. Say four. Four seems safe, because he hasn't put Keza out yet. But he, he's, I'm, he's looking at it, he probably wants to destroy it. If he's looking at it. I'm assuming. Or he's just like, what the fuck does Shelob do? Because <laughs> who plays Shelob? Um, okay, so what does he do here? If he kills Shelob, we're in a not great position, but if he doesn't, then we... Then I think we're sitting pretty well. It kind of depends what he does here. Does he play Keza? Well, he's looking at Shelob, so she's probably dead. Yep. Uh, yep. That's fine. Well, actually, this isn't great. <clears throat> Okay. Hmm. Huh. This is kind of not great. I have nothing to use these uh, fight spells on. Unless I can do th this, I don't think works, right? God damn it. 
I assumed it would work. Whoops. Okay, well that sucks. <laughs> uh, for some reason I thought it would work, but I, he's not a creature, technically. So it makes sense that it couldn't use any power or toughness. That's fine. Okay. So, I mean, I have Shelob, but he's he could probably kill her. I'm assuming. Yeah, this is kind of bad. Kind of bad for us. I hope we get something that we can use. Or not, that's fine. Gain a life. Maybe I should have grabbed Daxos. Yeah, like, what are the- what are these? Yeah, okay. I'm assuming he can probably kill it. Good game. Okay, well, that's not... That's unfortunate, if he's saying that. Oh, wait, does he win? No way he wins, right? Whenever you draw a card, target opponent loses life and you gain life. I see. Infinite combo. I love him. Alright, well. Yeah, turns out she love not that great. Uh she really needs to be on the battlefield and she costs six fucking mana, so it's highly unlikely that she'll stay there or get there. So yeah, if I, if you're playing Golgari, I would not recommend Shelob. Um, unless you're playing Commander. Obviously, this isn't really Commander. So, I don't know. I think she's probably more viable there, but that's it for MTG. Love y'all. God bless.